Today we'll be discussing the violent case of 50-year-old James and 48-year-old Lisa Goy, a married couple from Plains Township, Pennsylvania. On the 1st of February 2021, at around 9.30 a.m., the Goys were shoveling snow outside of their house and appeared to be placing the snow on the driveway of their neighbor, 47-year-old Jeffrey Spade. Spade was a decorated war veteran, working as an engineer for 20 years after serving the U.S. Navy in the 90s. All in all, Spade apparently had an ordinary life. No criminal records or notable offenses until this fateful encounter with his neighbors that cold February morning. According to NBC News, the Goys were dumping the snow they shoveled on Spade's property. Shortly after, Spade walked up to the couple to ask them to stop, which they did not. This led to a heated altercation, including threats and obscenities. You go fuck yourself, you fucking queer. Call me a scummy motherfucker. Step out here, I'll knock your ass out. Eventually, Spade can be seen walking back to his house before coming back to the scene with a handgun. James warns Spade to put the gun down while Lisa Goy provokes Spade, telling him to quote-unquote, go ahead. Jeffrey Spades then shot multiple times before hitting James first and then moving on to Lisa. James is seen fleeing towards his home, shouting for his neighbors to call the cops. Spade then proceeds to shoot at the couple multiple times, switching weapons during the process. The second time, Spade returns with an assault rifle to attack the couple once more. He then leaves the scene and shoots himself in his home shortly after with a third gun. Both parties involved had family and friends who wished it had ended differently. Lisa and James Goy had a 15-year-old autistic son who had moved under custody of his grandmother. Whilst many people explained that the shooting of the Goys was inhumane and completely unnecessary, others defended Spades as the couple had supposedly been bullying him on occasions prior to this one. This case is extremely violent and quickly fell out of control. I personally think Spades should have been arrested and that suicide prevented his deserved consequence. What do you think of this case? I read all the comments and love hearing what you guys have to say, whether it's love, hate, or any kind of statement at all. Thank you so much for watching.